Hello, this is Peter from First Math. Today we're going to look at Year 2, Block 2, Assessment Paper 1. Answers at the end of the quiz. First we'll start off by looking at the mental math question. The first five questions in this assessment are to be given orally to the whole class and group. Question one. Six sweets, add two more. How many all together? Pause the video until you are ready for question two. Here comes question two. Question two. Eight candles, blow five out. How many are left? Pause the video until you are ready for question three. Here comes question three. Question three. Seven add something equals ten. Four plus something equals ten. What are the missing numbers? Pause the video until you are ready for the next question. Here comes the next question. Question four. What number comes next? 10, 12, 14, 16, and then something. Pause the video until you are ready for the next question. Here comes question five. Question 5a. What equipment would I use to measure the amount of water in a cup? Would I use a 30 centimeter ruler? A meter stick, scales, clock, or a measuring jug? Pause the video until you are ready for the next question. Question 5b. What unit of measurement would I use to measure water? Put a tick next to the correct answer. Kilograms, meters, hours, milliliters, or grams. Pause the video until you're ready for the next question. Here comes the next question. It's a written test. Is question six. Write the number that has eight tens and seven units in numbers and words. Pause the video until you are ready for question seven. Here comes question seven. Question seven. Sixty-four equals something plus four. Ninety plus something equals ninety-seven. Pause the video until you're ready for question eight. Here comes question eight. Question eight. Put a ring around all the odd numbers. Thirty-three, twenty-four, fifteen, nineteen, forty-two, fifty, and sixty-three. Pause the video until you are ready for question 9. Here comes question 9. Question 9. 17 count on 30 is what? 81 count back 50 is what? Pause the video until you are ready for question 10. Here comes question 10. Question 10. Using the numbers 4 8 and 12, and the symbols plus and minus, make three more number sentences. 4 plus 8 equals 12. What are the other three number sentences I could make using these symbols and numbers? Pause the video until you are ready for question 11. Here comes question 11. Question 11. What is the total amount of lemonade? 2 litres plus 5 litres plus 8 litres. What does that make? Pause the video until you are ready for the next question. Here comes the next question. Question 12. Draw no more than 4 coins to pay for the boat. Pause the video until you are ready for the next question. 
Here comes the next question. Question 13. 8 plus 9 plus 4 makes what? 6 plus 5 plus 4 equals what? Pause the video and solve the question. Here comes the next question. Question 14. Mrs. Ball has 18 children in her class. Half of them are boys. How many are girls? Pause the video until you're ready for question 15. Here comes question 15. Question 15. Put a tick next to the bottle which will hold the least amount of water. Pause the video until you are ready for question 16. Here comes question 16. Question 16. Sam pours some pop into the jug until it contains one and a half litres. Colour the pop in the jug. How much more pop will Sam have to add to make two litres? Pause the video until you are ready to answer the question. Here comes question 17. Question 17. The arrow makes a quarter turn anti-clockwise. Put a tick next to the object it will point to. Pause the video until you are ready for question 18. Here comes question 18. Question 18 is a long one. Bananas are 13 pence. An orange is 12 pence. Grapes are 19 pence, an apple is 10 pence, a strawberry is 7 pence, and a pear is 11 pence. A. What is the total cost of a banana and an apple? B. What is the difference in price between the strawberry and the orange? C. If you buy some grapes and a banana, how much change will you get from 50 pence? D. The total cost of all the fruit is 72 pence. Draw three coins to show this amount. Pause the video until you are ready for question 19. Here comes question 19. Question 19. Jenny bought 12 bars of chocolate. Each one cost two pence. How much did Jenny spend? Pause the video until you are ready for question 20. Here comes Question 20. Question 20. Sam's cup holds 120 millilitres of pop. He drinks 40 millilitres. How much is left in his cup? Pause the video until you are ready for the next question. Question 21. In Nita's class, each pupil's tray holds five books. How many trays are needed to hold 25 books? Pause the video until you are ready for the next question. Here comes the next question. Question 22. Carol has three and a half oranges. Daniel has two and a half. How many oranges can they make all together? Pause the video until you are ready for question 22. Here comes question 23. Question 23. Fill in the missing numbers on the number line. 0, 3, 6, something, 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 18. Pause the video until you are ready for the next question. Here comes the next question. Question 24. Put a tick on the right angles on these shapes. Pause the video until you are ready for question 25. Here comes question 25. Nope, it stops at 24. And so we're having the answers now. Ready? Question 1. 8, 2, 3, 3, question 3, 3 and 6. Question 4, 18. Question 5, measuring jug and millilitres. Question 6. 
Question 7. 60 and 7. Question 8. 33, 15, 19, 63. 9. 47 and 31. Question 10. 8 plus 4 equals 12. 12 take away 8 equals 4. 12 take away 4 equals 8. Question 11. 15 litres. 12. Any combination of 4 or less coins, which total 25p. 12. Any combination of 4 or less coins to total 25p. 13. 21 and 15. 14. 9. 15. Tick the small bottle. 16. Colour to one and a half litre mark. And it, to get to two litres, you add another half a litre. 17. Arrow to ice cream. 18A. 23P. 18B. 5P. 18C. 18P. 18D. 50p, 20p, 2p, 19, 24p, 20, 80 millilitres, 21, 5 to 8, 22, 6 oranges, 23, 9, 12, 15, 24, 1 tick on the right angle triangle in the corner, 4 ticks on the rectangle. Click on more of my videos. Because by simply clicking on the middle button, you can subscribe to my channel. You will be one of the first to know when I have uploaded new maths resources. Every one of my maths resources is designed to make maths teaching easier and more fun. To explore more of my first maths channel, please click on one of the two videos here. Have fun and love maths. And I look forward to seeing you again very soon. Have a great day. Bye.